Argentina is located in the southern corner of the American continent. It covers 2.78 million square kilometers of land with diverse climates. It's divided into 23 provinces and its capital city is Buenos Aires. The official language of the country is Spanish and its current population is 44.5 million inhabitants. Argentina is the first country in South America to offer a bachelor's degree in music therapy. The first music therapy course started on the 23rd of July in 1967, hence the reason to celebrate the Argentinian Music Therapy Day on this date. There are currently six universities where one can study music therapy. Amongst them, we find the University of Buenos Aires, a public university that offers free education for every student. The professional profile of Argentine music therapists include professionals who work within hospital, community and educational settings. In 2015, the national law for the professional practice of music therapy was approved. This national law protects all music therapists across the country in addition to the existing laws that are in effect in various provinces. The profession is regulated by the National Ministry of Health and each music therapist has a registration number that enables them to practice as such. There is a National Association of Music Therapy as well as other regional and provincial associations. At present, music therapists are working in 21 out of 23 provinces in the country. Although there is a tendency to work from a psychodynamic perspective, we find that music therapists also practice from biomedical, neurological and evidence-based perspectives. Within hospital settings, music therapists can develop their professional careers attending residency programs that take place in the city of Buenos Aires and in the province of Chubut. Nowadays, we can find music therapists working in general hospitals as well as in psychiatric hospitals and neurological rehabilitation clinics. In each of these cases, they are part of the permanent interdisciplinary team and work alongside other healthcare professionals.